To begin, we'll create a trig sequence by simply tapping the Track When Record button. The recorded triggers and gates will loop on track 1. The resulting loop can also be overdubbed as you continue to press the record button. Now that we have our trig sequence recorded, we can record some CV data for the 1 volt per octave input on braids. We engage pitch quantize mode using the appropriate shift function. Then, we proceed to record our loop by setting the knob to the position that we want and recording using the track 4 record button. As our sequence plays through, we continue to move the knob and overdub until we have a pitch sequence that we like. Now we'll record some continuous CV data for the timber input on braids, allowing us to control the damping of our patch in time with our sequence. For recording, we disengage quantize mode. Then, we proceed as before, this time using track 2. We can continue to overdub and alter the recording over time. Here, we increase the frequency of triggers. Individual tracks can be muted and unmuted by holding down shift and pressing the corresponding record button. The loop length can be altered by holding down the length button and turning the CV knob. Here, we set our length to two beats and create a new pitch sequence.